Hello everyone, welcome back to LS PDFR. Guys, so we have put back in Jurisdiction 4. Um, so I have a request to do a patrol down here at the campus. So we're going to do campus police today. Where I also had a request to use this vehicle. This is BX Bugs' is Crime Vic. This Crime Vic has been out for a long time over on LSPDFR.com. Um, I had a request to do it. So we're going to use it today. Make sure everything is set up here. We'll get out here and get on patrol. Let me get my timer started. And we'll show you the lights of this uh, crime beat. Now, the only problem with this crime beat that I've noticed, and it's actually an ELS issue, it's not the car itself, it's the ELS issue, which is the lighting on the car. Uh, sometimes you will see a uh, light in the middle of the, of the light bar, the light will be stuck on. It's not all the time, it's, it's, it happens occasionally, but this is older mod, so that happens with some of these older mods that does happen, that I've noticed. So, here's your stage one lighting for this car. I gotta fix the taxi too, guys, so just ignore that. But here's your stage one lighting for the cars. For this car. Your stage two lighting. Your stage three lighting for big Xboxes Crown Vic. Awesome looking car. Interior. It's got the red light up there. Got your shotgun, your speaker, your rifle, computer. Alright. And I will show you what we'll, what we patrol. That we are campus police. So campus police pretty much covers all of Richmond. All this area here is, is our jurisdiction. So we will kind of stay in that area and do our patrol. So let's get ahead and see what we can get into. So I had a lot of requests to put back in jurisdiction for us. So I went ahead and done it. We're not going to do five right now. Um, I'm thinking what I'm going to do, I'm going to wait until the game updates again. Because it's going to be updating very soon. With another new DLC. So we'll, uh, we'll do it then. I'm gonna stop this vehicle because they have an expired license. And these are a stop sign. Are they running? No. Okay. That would be the first way you start off, huh? With a pursuit. So campus police has a uh, has the big focus crime book. It has two um, Union King Paul six eight three a traffic violation. Two twenty sixteen uh, chargers and it has a um a thirteen Tahoe and a fifteen Tahoe. Police buddy's picking an uh, odor of alcohol. Good evening. Uh, Officer Renette with the Campus Police Department of Los Santos Campus Police Department. May I see some ID, please? Stop, so you can get your ID, please. Get the passenger's ID today. Thanks. May I, see some I gotta ID, fix please? the taxis, guys, so just ignore the taxis for right now. Thanks. Alright. Alright, we're well, sit tight. Now, I don't work down here much, guys, because traffic down here is just so bad down here around this campus. Alright, so we'll run both their names. He does have a spider license. He's good. Uh, he does have a gun permit. All that is active. Uh, his handgun has been canceled, but he has a, a gun permit. Okay. So we're gonna get the driver out because we did get we did get an odor of alcohol coming, but we're gonna go ahead and get both of them out of the vehicle.
fucking crazy. Ain't so we're gonna talk to the driver. Wait there. Ain't got time for this. Have him follow me over here. And our partner is going. Is going she, he's going. She's going to watch our the passenger of the vehicle. Got time for this. So he's going to do a, a DUI test now. All right, sir. We're going to be doing a DUI test on you today. Go. We do have a belief that you are this. under influence of alcohol, or, or your passenger is one. Ain't got time for this. Go, go. Hey, buddy. All right. So he failed that. Ain't got time for this. He said, "We're so I can't get. I ain't got time for this." It's uh your visual settings guys what causes that with the taxi. I got I've I've got to fix it, so just bear with me. I know how to fix it and I will. Ain't got time for this. Will you hush over? Ain't got time for this. Hey man. Ain't got time for this. Thanks. Okay, we're gonna place him in the custody because he failed every test except for the breathalyzer. So, you're under arrest. Well, that that word he he hushed over there. All right, sir, you'll be placed under arrest tonight for DUI. Uh, you failed you failed every test except for the breathalyzer. So, you're gonna be placed under arrest for that. All right, has a large amount of cash and some Mary Jane. Hold up. Right. Put him in our car. Now, guys, if you want to use this vehicle, be exposed. It also has an option for this vehicle. If you want to use it to where it can be all blue. Let's go ahead and dismiss him. All right, you can go now. Excuse me. All right, so we're going to talk to this guy here. Wait there. Go ahead and check in. I need one more time. And he's clean. We're gonna check the vehicle. He's clean. I'm gonna and he has clean license. So if there's nothing bad in the vehicle, we'll let him take the vehicle. Oh, he's got three grams of white powder. There's three grams of white powder in the vehicle. We could charge the driver for that. It's on the driver's side. All right, sir. So your friend tonight, I don't know if it's your brother or your friend or whoever it is, um, he's going to jail uh, for, for driving under the influence. Um, we're going we're gonna to be really nice tonight. We're going to let you take the vehicle. You come back clean. There was some drugs in the vehicle. It's on the driver's side. We're going to let you take the vehicle. We normally don't do that. We normally we do uh, impound it. But tonight we're going to be nice. We're going to let you take it. We going out later? Just a warning this shit. time, okay? Bullshit. So we're gonna go ahead. He's gonna be charged with DUI. He's also gonna be charged with um. Did he hit my partner? Okay. Why did he get out? We didn't want him to get out of the vehicle. Okay. So not gonna let us check it. So let's put him back. We'll just he can stay out. We're gonna call a transport unit, pick him up anyway. So that that'll be okay. We don't have time for no pursuit. There. All right. 
So he's going to go to jail. I'm going to uh, let the license slide. He's going to go to jail for DUI. I'm going to give him a charge for the drugs that was in the vehicle. Alright, All right, we're going to have a uh, transport come by and pick him up. In Richmond. Charger going to come by and pick him up there. So they're going to take him in. So let's see if we can get a call over here in Richmond. Do something different other than traffic. Dispatch to all SWAT units. We've got a person with a firearm and grape seed units respond code three. That's it. The Air Force. Attention, this is dispatch. We are code four. We got a report of the brandishing weapon here in Richmond. We're gonna head over there. Units respond code three. Now this car does have the different patterns when you're responding. Your siren tone changes, it does change the light patterns. Which is awesome. Let's see here. It's probably gonna be at this rest of this right here. We're gonna get some backup units down here too. We're not gonna enter. Get two backup units. Copy, that's a code two on our way. The person with a weapon, so we're not gonna take no chances. Copy that, dispatch. Animals on the loose. Grab my shotgun. Alright, we should have one more unit in route. We'll go ahead and enter the property while I'm waiting on that unit to get here. There we go. He's here now. Alright. Go, go. Campus PD! Police Department! Reports for a person with a weapon. It's all clear here. Alright, we're, we're, we're checking this area. He may not be in this area. We're checking this area just to make sure. This is where most of the yellow is on the map, so this is what we're looking at right at this minute. And as right now, we don't see anything. Okay. This area is clear.
So we're gonna go up a little bit and see if he uh, is up this way. It's just a tad. At the next house right here. Idiot. Alright. This is a witness, okay. Okay, so he's the suspect. Clear code four. Suspect neutralized. No further units required. Sometimes it goes bad when you have those calls, and that's why I did call them back up. Um, sometimes it, it's this Everyone, kind of situation. Required in Richmond. So we'll call it the EMS out here to check him out. Uh, he had a large amount of cash, a 90s hip hop CD, a cell phone, 10 baggies of 1 and 8 ounce of white powder. So I'm guessing the ambulance is, is lost. There it comes. They're going to check him out. I don't think he survived with all the weapons on him, but we'll, we'll see. I didn't think he did, but you know, we we need to call EMS just to make sure it is a policy thing. All right, so we'll call corner. We'll go ahead and dismiss our backup. Assistance required in uh, Richmond. Thanks. I'm gonna move our car. Up here. While we wait on corner to get here. I'm gonna go ahead and put my shotgun up. Cause we're not gonna need it. I really guys would like to see a, a, a jurisdiction mod that has this included with all the other ones. Uh, uh, there's not many out there that gives you all the apartments, and I'd love to see all the other departments plus campus police. And the ones that's out there that I use, uh, like this one here for jurisdiction 4, it has campus police, but then you don't have all the agencies in the city. You have to use LSPD. So I really would like to see one come out that has everything, every agency, you know, campus and all that added together. That would be really cool because I, I would definitely use it. Alright. So he's been picked up. We'll uh, get back on patrol. Corner is uh, leaving the area. Citizens reporting use of explosives in Pacific Bluff. I do believe that's out of our area. Mm, yeah, that's up in the county. 
So we're going to kind of go down this way. I'm trying to stay in the right area here. We can turn down this road and go back up and circle back around. Right, that tax is coming back stolen. We're out of our jurisdiction. We're going to stop it. What are they doing? Are they taking now? Yeah, we're way out of our jurisdiction now. But we're going to stop it. License plate 83 Union Henry Hall 322. A traffic violation, a possible stolen vehicle, a traffic felony. Approach with caution. Alright, since we're in LSPD's territory and this is a stolen vehicle, we're going to get a, a backup here and come down. Assistance required in Pacific Bluff. Good evening, sir. Officer Burnett with the with the um, campus police department. May I see some ID, please? I'm trying to turn that way, guys, so the light won't be so bright in everybody's face. Okay. Is this your vehicle? Well, our our AR system picked up that this uh, vehicle is stolen. We're gonna ask him if it is his vehicle. I just, yes, I just hope I have all the paperwork, okay? Alright, so sit tight. So we're going to run the vehicle. The taxi, I guess because it don't belong, well it says owner here, but it actually belongs to the city of Los Santos. Um, it, it is stolen, it has an expired registry insurance. This is the owner. He has a suspended license. Cause this guy has a warrant and places him with a stolen vehicle, he has an expired license. So. We're going to issue him a citation for a license. Over 30 days. And he's going to be arrested. Damn. 
Alright, sir. We'll be issuing you a citation today for your expired license. Make sure you get that took care of. Also, we're going to have you step out of the vehicle. Whoa, shit. We're going to do a breathalyzer on him, too, and see if he has been drinking. Police buddy did pick up other alcohol. All right, follow me back here and find the cruiser. So we're going to ask him, has he been drinking? He says, nope. I have the right to silence. Okay. I'm a good citizen. What are you doing here? Need some fresh air. Where are you coming from? Home. Where are you going? Work. I need to talk to you for a few minutes. It's beginning to. Okay. So we're going to do a breathalyzer on him, um, PBT and all that. He's going to jail anyway because he has a warrant and uh, he's got in possession of a stolen vehicle, so. Oh, he failed that one. The walker turn. We're going to make sure we get him for everything. But you get in that vehicle. He's fishing getting that vehicle. I'm gonna fucking lose it. Come on. Call me back over here. That's a bug that they need to fix sometimes where it does that. So stand on one, on one leg. Howdy. All right, we'll run breath lives early. Thanks. All right. All right, sir. At this time, you'll be placed in arrest. You have multiple charges. You have a warrant for your arrest. You also you in possession of a stolen vehicle and also DUI. Hey, what the fuck? In a small of cash, a business card to to the tattoo shop, a toy revolver with no safety trigger. All units, we've got gunshots reported in uh, Backlot City. Units respond code three. All right, so we'll search the vehicle and get it out of here. Let me turn this way. I'm trying to do it so it doesn't blind it, but I still got to fix that. All right, on the driver's side, a ball of transmission fluid. The passenger side had an open ball of whiskey, a pawn shop ticket with a large amount of jewelry, and a trunk had nothing of interest. All right, so let's get a tow truck out here to pick it up. Flatbed, assistance required in Pacific Bluff. I sent this candy and just went by. Mm. 
Alright, so he's going to jail for his warrant. He's going for DUI. He's also going for possession of a stolen vehicle. Well, let LSPD take him in. Assistance required in uh, Pacific Bluff. We're gonna head back to Richmond. Back up to our jurisdiction. Is this bus drunk? Bus just run red light. Look at well, the buses are a lot harder to stop. I'm not gonna deal with him. They don't really listen to your uh, sirens and stuff. So. Units. We have shots fired. All units respond. Code 99. Yeah, they don't respond too well to pullovers. That's something that was never really fixed. Back over in our area now. Hey, man. Hey, sir. Let's take a run by the campus here. Just make sure everything's okay. Attention, all units. Units respond code three. That's in Rocker Hills. Hey, buddy. I'm gonna try to make sure I fix those uh, taxes and stuff very soon. What is this taxi doing? We're gonna stop this taxi. That driving was a little bit ridiculous, I just see. So there's not really a lot goes on guys down here at the campus. Mostly what goes on down here is traffic stops and stuff like that. You get called there once in a while. 
A traffic violation. Approach with caution. Has expired insurance. Got a faster partner, watch it. May I see some ID, please? Good morning, sir. Yeah. Thanks. We stopped you for that erratic driving back there you were doing. Also, you have expired insurance. What's going on with that? Hey, buddy. Okay. All right. We well, sit tight. Inside view of the car on the traffic stop. Camera shot. All right. Let's see who the taxi belongs to. All right, so he's going to get a ticket for his expired insurance. He's going to get one also for his driving. Let's see. Wooden violation. Okay, sir, you're receiving you will be receiving two citations today. Uh, one is for your expired insurance. You need to make sure you get that taken care of right away. The next is for careless operation of motor vehicle. We I've seen the way you was driving back there, and uh, we're not gonna have that. So, yeah, please remember you are around a school too. This is a campus, a, a college, so you can't be driving like that, especially around here. So, all right, and have a good day. So it's a simple traffic stop there. Make sure call outs didn't get turned off, they're not saying nothing. Attention, this is dispatch. We are code four. We got reports of a stolen um, police hardware. So we're en route to that. Go oh in this vehicle right here. He's hit a pedestrian. Taxi. Oh. Try to get him over as much as I can. A little bit more. This is going to be a problem down here. I know it. All right. the plate target vehicle license plate on Washington Zero, seven boy Ida Adam two five one a traffic violation approach with caution ah. 
All right, we're gonna get a backup unit down here. We're, we're gonna call a state unit. Assistance needed in Richmond. Good evening, sir. Hey, your last real straight proof I am Officer Burnett with a with a Thanks. campus police department over here at the campus. All right, I'll be right back with you, sir. Reason why we stopped you over there? We had reports of a uh, you have stolen police uh, property in your vehicle. No? Okay. Well, we're gonna find out. Just sit tight. SHP is on the scene. Love the light bar on that, Taurus. Okay, he's good. He has expired insurance. I think we do something a little bit different and call in a state unit. And SHP has showed up. So, all right, sir. Why don't you step out of the vehicle? We're gonna have to search the vehicle. We have proper cause because we believe there is a stolen police weapon in the vehicle. So. Walk right over here. We're gonna pat you down. We're gonna pat down the. We're gonna search the vehicle. Well, I'm meant for me to do it. Partner searching him. I'll uh, search the vehicle. As a uh, he has a Glock. 19T, but that's not our vehicle, our, our weapon. It is a stolen police rifle, pack of cigarettes, and a bar of candy on the driver's side. Alright, sir. Roger that. At this time, you'll be placed under arrest. Oh, it crashed. Well, I don't know if I can get back my vehicle. Nope. It crashed. The call crashed. Well, guys, this is where we're going to end the call. We're going to end it right here, anyways. It was the end of the video. Um, so, thank you for everyone that's been watching this, the videos. Thank you for everyone that's been subscribed to the channel. Um, I did have a request to do this down here at the uh, campus police down here, so that's what we done. And we did have a request to you, Big Bug, just crying, Vic. Um, so thank you for everyone that's been subscribing, and um, have a good day.